guys, Jared Ritz here from United Country Real Estate. Uh, just on my way to the Columbia Gorge to uh, actually show off some country homes for some potential buyers. Um, they, uh, they're they looking for 10 or 20 acres with mountain views, uh, just something really unique and they've uh, kind of contracted our services to, uh, to find them something. Um, you know, I just want to give you guys a quick market update um, for Southwest Washington. Um, you know, I've had a lot of contractors, foresters, landowners, etc. reach out and say, Jared, what's happening? What's going to happen in this market? Um, I always kind of chuckle when they call a realtor for stuff like that. Although we always sound like we know what we're talking about, a lot of people don't. Um, I actually usually rely um, on my lenders for a lot of this information. Um, and then also, um, I have some friends in the banking system that are a little bit closer to the action. and. And uh, they're, they're usually the better person to ask the question to. I also tend to ask people over the age of 75 what they think is going to happen because they've seen the market a lot more than I have in my lifetime. Um, but my two cents are is that we're going to continue to see housing prices drop gradually. Um, I don't think we're going to see anything like we saw in 2008. Um, I think, you know, good news for you guys, if you're into lifestyle properties, that are unique, that have land, that have trees, uh, and that are not a dime a dozen, I think that those land prices are gonna continue to stabilize. I think time on market is gonna be a little bit longer. Um, you know, rather than being five days on market, we're starting to see 45 days on market. Um, but I definitely think that with the California influence of buyers, uh, as well as Seattle money coming to Southwest Washington, um, land and lifestyle real estate is not going to fall off um, by any means. Uh, and I think if you've invested in lifestyle real estate, uh, I think you're you're in good shape. You know, when I started a uh, real estate in Southwest Washington, um, I kind of foresaw um, that what we had there was really unique um, in that um, by not specializing in urban listings, but rural listings, uh, I would also be protecting myself uh, in case there ever was a, a slump in the economy. Uh, I don't think we're gonna see interest rates go down necessarily. I think they're gonna probably stabilize at around six or 7%. Um, it's not uncommon if they go up. Uh, and in the grand scheme of things, the, these interest rates are still pretty good. Uh, when my dad uh, purchased a lot of his real estate in the late 80s, he borrowed at 18%. Um, so 6% would look like a steal uh, back in those days. Of course, we're all a little bit bitter. We didn't um, get lending at 2.75%, but everybody's playing in the same arena. And if you're a buyer, um, you have to remember that the home you're purchasing is now less. Uh, and if you're a seller and a buyer, or you're doing a sell buy, um, sure, you're a little bummed that your house isn't worth as much as it was two or three months ago, but the property you're buying also uh, will be a lower price. So I think hang tight, it's still a great time to sell your home. Um, and right now, more than any time, knowing the market is uh, really important. If you guys said, uh, you know, just want to shoot the breeze and talk about real estate and the market, um, feel free. We'll go for a coffee or a beer. Look me up on my Facebook page at Jared Ritz Real Estate. Uh, you can private message me or you can text me on my cell phone, 360 612 2079. Hope that gives you guys some insights as to what's kind of happening um, in the market today. Cheers.